Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today I'm bringing you a first. This is the first of our 2021 Atlases that we just received on a truck. I think in the wake of the pandemic virus, the pandemic coronavirus, um, they're rushing cars out to get them out of the factory lots and on the uh, dealership lots. So uh, we just got a bunch that we didn't know were that were coming. Here's a look at them right here. So we got quite a few, but this is the first one. This is a 2021 Volkswagen Atlas SE with technology R-Line V6. This is in pyrite silver, features the new Atlas front end with LED running lights, LED uh, headlights, uh, all weather lights that are also LED, new front R-Line grille, and the same 20 inch Trenton wheels although they're painted darker. So I believe this color is gonna be called anthracite. So it's a darker gray. Same nice long bold lines down the side of the car. Let's close the gas cap here. Nice bold lines there. The changes are in the back with the tail lights. More Audi-esque on the tail lights with the kind of like, I call it a shark fin. Uh, also, you have new exhaust tips down below, similar to the Crossport, and a big long reflector along the back of the car at the base of the or in the middle of the bumper. There, there's a look at your tow hitch on the back. Piano black treatment around that exhaust tip still. Nice long line there catches the light, and the new R Line logo right here on the side. And into the door, just like the 2019, 2018, and 2017. Or sorry, there wasn't a 2017. But here's your R-Line badge on the front. Again, this is pyrite silver. This particular one does have a panoramic sunroof as an added option. That's a $1,200 option on the car. I do like the new taillights. They go right into the silver strip on the back. As we hop inside, let's take a look. Another difference here, white stitching along the set, the edge of the seats here. A little more of an upgraded seat now in the bolster. Inside, not much difference here. You still have power door locks. You have a, um, a carbon fiber type finish here with a silver surround. Um, I think you did have uh, a, just a silver, a brushed aluminum look before. Uh, with the uh, mirrors now, you still have the power mirrors. What's missing is the heated mirror icon right there because the heated mirrors are now integrated into uh, the defrost setup. One touch up, one touch down on all four windows. Then you also have a window lock right there. Uh, remote trunk release, trunk release right there, a hatch release. I can open that using that button right there. And then I can hold it up and also close it. Super nice that I can do that. Instrument cluster wise, no change there. Still the same instrument cluster with the LCD screen in the middle. Uh, you do have uh, a new steering wheel though. This steering wheel is still the flat bottom steering wheel. New R-Line logo there. More silver in the spokes here. There's a little fatter spokes. They were piano black trimmed before. Uh, it's kind of reversed now. Anything that was silver is now black. Anything that's, uh, and this, the buttons, the mapping sequence is still the same. Uh, there's your cruise control functionality, your following distance. Uh, and then your driver assistant systems. You have something called side assist, not at your blind spot, still still up there. Uh, and then uh, rear traffic alert and front assist. Automatic headlights, gone are fog lights. You now have all weather lights in place of those. It still works the same way. You pull out on this here and that little guy lights up right there. It's a side lamp that actually helps light your, your peripherals. Uh, coin box stays, telescoping steering wheel stays here, but this is an all new steering wheel. Uh, this has the new Volkswagen logo on it. I like that. It's much, much crisper, clean look. Also, on our line units, you get this uh, textured uh, grip, kind of like a sport grip, racing grip over here. The only thing they're missing now are paddle shifters. Um, they're not going to put paddle shifters on an Atlas, just so you know. Um, but you do have this textured grip, grip here. It's much nicer. Uh, and then also, uh, you have the MIB2 radio, your AM, FM, and satellite radio. It stays the same. You do have that same backup camera with trajectory steering, so you can turn the cam or turn the wheel, uh, and it shows you where you're headed. The green line shows which straight back. The red line shows where your bumper is. 
Uh, the card does come with App Connect. That get, allows you to do Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, or MirrorLink using one of these two USBs down here. Two USBs is an upgrade that did show up in 2020 models, but not very many dealers got 2020s. We got two, um, and we traded for a third, so we didn't see many 2020s. But in 2019, you only had one USB up here, and now you have two. Along with that, um, that auxiliary port there and a 12-volt charger port there. Speaking of charging, you do have wireless charging now in this car. There's a wireless charge mat right down there. Okay, so you can charge your phone there. Um, as for the pedal caps, there's still that silver or chrome covered pedal caps. Um, you do add for 2021, you do have a uh, park pilot assist on a SE with tech that did show up in the 2020s as well. Again, we didn't have that many of them it was a very short build year. So in 2021, you do have park, uh, pilot where you can push that button and it brings up the camera on the screen and then you can do, um, uh, sensor adjustments where you can adjust the, the pitch the tone of those sensors here's your e-brake right here same as before just push down the release you do have uh, the all-wheel drive set up so you can do snow eco normal sport or custom and then also you have off-road and custom off-road which allows you to tweak different things just like you could before so no difference there either Armrest, still the same size, white stitching now. You do have a USB port here, so you have three USBs up front instead of before you had two. In the glove box, you have a CD player with an SD card reader there and two, I'm sorry, four extra SD card holders right there. This one here does have uh, rain sensing wipers as well. LED light now for your vanity mirror. That's an upgrade, that's nice. It's, well, it's not an upgrade, it's a change. Same on this side over here. As for CarNet, it is free. For five years that's information roadside assistance and also emergency services there's a look at that giant panoramic sunroof with a power sunshade that sunroof does open up and stack on top of the la the last section of glass there so this section opens up with a pop-up windscreen to cut down on wind noise there you go super nice people have that car guys here's a tip if you want your wife to get this car and you don't want to spend a lot of money do not let her see the sunroof do not because you're gonna be spending more money there's a look at that again. It goes all the way from the back to the front. I'm actually gonna leave that open. Let's take a look at the second row. This one comes in at 45, 630. Extras on this one are gonna be that sunroof for 1200 bucks. Captain's chairs in the second row for 695. A towing package for 550 with 5,000 pounds of uh, maximum towing. Monster mats for 285 uh, and then a, a cargo cover is 200 bucks and a roadside assistance kit is another 85. Again, that's 45, 630 for this one. Here's a look at that second row captain's chair setup. Also, the white stitching continues here. And nothing's really changed here other than that. Um, now, that stitching does add a more of a premium feel to the car. Um, and these seats do have the latch hook up here and also over there. And if you guys are new to the Atlas game and you're not sure what's so special about this car, a uh, big thing is if you have front facing car seats, this lifts up and pushes forward you don't have to remove a car seat to get a get into the third row there's a look at the access to the third row those headrests do flip up notice how high off the floor that um, seat sets so you're not slammed on the floor and your knees aren't in your chest so this translates into lots of leg room and headroom as the roof line is sculpted even with a sunroof in here you still have that sculpted roof line right there or headliner I should say another change for the 2021 Atlas is down here you have two USBs and now you have a three-prong plug-in 115 volt plug-in right there there's a look at the climate control for the back you can lock this out where your passengers cannot have access to it so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you I failed to mention this up here this has tr uh, three zone climate control so you've got everything set on high here I can adjust the temperature I can adjust fan speed I can adjust all of those different things there and then I can also uh, close it out and I can adjust temperature there as well super nice that I can do that I can do it down here with the controls or I can do it on a touch screen if you do it on a touch screen you're gonna get fingerprints all over unless you're wearing gloves hello pandemic uh, but uh, if you if you don't want if you want the coolness of it you're a tech guy it's kind of cool to do it up there show your friends 
Here's a look at the panoramic sunroof again. Giant, covers the first two rows. There's a look at what it looks like right there. The steering wheel, uh, the layout there. Nice, nice layout there. Let's take a look at the rear hatch. Oh, and by the way, these seats do fold flat as well. So if I move this seat all the way back, I can fold this seat down. It clicks in place, and I can also fold this seat down. I can fold down all four seats, and it'll have all the space nice and flat. Let's take a look at the back. Oh, one other thing I missed here. Sunshade right there. Built into every Atlas above the SE trim. There's a look at the LED tail lights. I want to go turn these on real quick so we can see them. There you go. Nice looking tail lights there. Really nice. As we open this up here, here's a look through from the back to the front. Giant panoramic sunroof. This is a true six seater. And if you want to fold it, pull fold this seat back up you just pull and it snaps back into the place this particular one as i said has a cargo cover right here cargo blocks for storage keeping things from sliding from side to side roadside assistance kit right here and monster mats below and on all the yard lines we'll put the license plate cover on the or license plate bracket on the front at customer request a lot of people say uh, i would buy this car but you put you drilled holes in the bumper so i don't want that one uh, underneath the floor right here there is your spare down below that carpet right there and a new jack apparatus is off to the side super nice car super super nice power lift gate right there and it does have remote start now the cool thing about what they did another cool thing that they did for the atlas for 2021 i'll show you right here is they updated the key fob this is your key fob now this is the same key fob they use on the Ardeon. it's a little heavier a little more substance chrome and polished VW logo on the back. Panic alarm on the side, still slim, but it gives it a little more weight. And as you can hear that plane flying overhead, just if you're interested in buying from me, you can fly in and drive out. Nice, nice key fob right there. All right, put that back in the car. This car does come with a four year, 50,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty from Volkswagen. That's four years, 50,000 miles. Two years of free maintenance are included in that. So your oil change, your tire rotation, multi-point inspection is covered for two years. Also, if you buy from me, Bomberito in St. Peter's, I will give you an extra year of free maintenance, a third year of free maintenance. And then also we're going to give you a 10-year, 200,000-mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty, free of charge. That's right, nationwide. Fly in from Wisconsin, drive out in a new car. If you're interested in this car, give me a call, 636-290-4257, 636-290-4257, on Instagram, YouTube, and Facebook at Reese Sells Cars. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a great day. Oh, and please stay safe. Uh, shelter in place. Wash your hands. Wear gloves. Practice social distancing. Please. It'll save your life. It may, it may not harm you, but it'll save someone you love. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a good day.